Okay, so uh, it's been a very long time since I last did a Let's Play on this channel. Uh, the last play I did, I think, was Pikmin 3 for the Wii U, is the donation drive. Um, and not too long ago, I came up with this idea for a brand new one with a bit of a gimmick. So for anyone viewing, you might notice, or at least you might recognize this logo. And uh, at the bottom it says, copyright 1996 Nintendo Square, etc., etc. We're about to play Super Mario RPG, The Legend of the Seven, Seven Stars. And by we, I mean me and my good friend Olive Branch. Hello. So, Olive Branch, uh, what is your history with this game? I want to say that I started playing this game when I was still living in Brazil. And I must have been maybe seven or eight years old at the time. And I had a really good time with it because... It helped me with develop my English skills, mm. and I must have played it maybe a maximum of 10 to 12 times throughout my life, but it's still one of my all-time favorite games. It is one of the greatest games of all time, honestly. Like, even 24 years later, it still hangs holds up, like, really, really well. Personally, I've played through this game, like, once every year and a half or something like that. Uh, I'm not going to say that i played it 100 times, definitely not, but <laughs> definitely north of at least 30 and every single time I play through this game, I learn something new. Just There's just a different secret to be found. There's a new Easter egg somewhere. Just whatever. It's just one of those kinds of games, right? Mm -hmm. And like my semi-annually whatever uh, playthrough of this game is coming up. But I decided I wanted to do something a little differently. So there's a randomizer of this game going around. And I'm actually uh, friends with one of the developers. I'm, we're not super, super close. Uh, we're more like acquaintances with a, with a, a common denominator. Hobby. Yeah. <laughs> and I wanted to give uh, the randomizer a try. So that's what we're running right now. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and unpause. And the first thing that you'll notice is that Mario has a very garish costume on right now. He's uh, very blue. Yeah, very navy blue. One of the options in this randomizer is that uh, the five main characters of the cast, they can have randomized palettes. And, you know, I just turn that on just because, you know, why not? Maybe we'll come up with a... Maybe we'll come up with a winner, but clearly we did not. Not with Mario. Yeah. I hope the other five... The other four fare better. <laughs> yeah. Mario definitely drew the short, stuck, short straw here. But on top of the randomizer, like, there's a whole bunch of settings on this randomizer. I'll actually post a... I I I I, blah, 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 blah. I will post the key to the settings that I used on this randomizer in the d description of this video and in uh, the thread on something awful. Do you want to give us a quick like big big changes highlights we should be aware of I, other than the palettes? I don't really remember most of the settings off the top of my head, but. Uh, but the big ones. Uh, the big ones. The equipment is randomized, and not just the stats, but who can use what. So, like, you know, the frying pan, Peach's ultimate weapon. It could go on Bowser. It could go on Mallow. I don't know. And where Wait, we did, and where we did find they it? Actually, yeah. Where we find it? I don't know. Well, I was gonna ask if, let's say that Bowser does get the frying pan. Um, does he actually have the animation for it? No. Uh, I don't know what they would do. I don't know what the uh, the developers of the randomizer did, but uh, it was possible in the vanilla game to put magic spells on characters that shouldn't learn it, like uh, you could give Psych Bomb to Gino, and what would happen is that in order to use it, Gino would actually morph into Peach, but with Gino's palette. Huh. So maybe that's what they did here. So that's, that's pretty cool. That's one thing. Another thing is uh, randomized item locations, including key items. There's Bowser. Uh, his palette looks a little better. He's at least uh, got a complementary scheme going. So yeah. did Gino, by the way. Yeah, I mean, Gino is using very dark, very bold colors, but at least he is still recognizably Gino. Whereas Mario, you can barely tell what he is besides like some kind of MS Paint monstrosity. <laughs> anyway, for the most part, uh, we'll learn uh, the what this randomizer has done with this particular seed as we go. But uh, I wanted to actually make this even crazier. Uh, the main gimmick to this Let's Play is that Super Mario RPG is typically a one-player game. Uh, you play as Mario in the overworld and you control whoever uh, characters that you assign to be in battle. Mm -hmm. However, you and I are going to play this multiplayer. How do we do that? 
in order to do that multiplayer, do this game multiplayer, you and I will swap out whoever has the controller in battle in order to use certain characters. And in order to determine who uses certain characters, I rigged up a very simple random number generator. And you can see that right here. You can't, but the, the viewers can, it'll be in the video. And it says here, player one is now Toadstool and player two is now Bowser. But I wanted to make this even messier. Mario, he is going to be run by this random number generator. So you'll see here, it says click here once the battle begins. Once the battle begins, the random number generator will decide uh, what Mario's action will be. It will roll a number between one and four. And that number that it pulls goes with uh, Mario's action. So like a one could be attack, a two could be defend. And if he pulls and up- And so on. And so on. And if he pulls up magic, it'll say what slot uh, of magic that he's going to use. And if he pulls up an item, it'll say what page and what slot and who he targets on, in both cases. Mm. So we got Gorgon, Hyden, Bakura, and Jinx. These are all enemies in Super Mario RPG. Neat. So rather than, I think it's just Mario 1, Mario 2. So just to prove, or rather just to test that this uh, control scheme works, I'm going to put in one letter, and then I'm going to hand off the control to you, Olive Branch, and then I want you to put in another letter. Awesome. And we'll just uh, work our, uh, our improv sure. skills. Go for it. Okay, so let's start us off. Let's start us off with something easy. I'll give you. I'll give you an M. Sweet. All right. Let's see. I think I will take. I'll give you something else easy. I'll give you an O. And uh, you can go ahead and. Whoops. Sorry. Uh, you can uh, go ahead and take control now. There we go. So, yeah, sorry viewers, we're still getting used to the uh, this switching. Is, this is, like I said, it's a bit of a gimmick, and it's going to take us a bit of time to get used to it, but it does work. Proof of concept. Uh, I'm going to toss you a curveball. Moke. You know, actually, in Portuguese, it is possible there is an actual food in Portuguese that starts with these first four letters. Do you want me to... Do you want me to uh, you go ahead, you can take it. Okay. Do you want me to tell you what it is? Uh, let me guess. I'll tell you. Yeah, go ahead. Is the next letter R? It is not, oh, sadly. Man. But uh, it would have been an E, and then a C, and then an A. Mukeka. Mukeka? What is it? It's a type of uh, seafood stew. It's delicious. Makur. Hmm. I'm gonna say with Mukura, which sounds like a. It sounds like a, it sounds like one of the enemies that we just saw on the main menu. Or so it did. Fa file select. Okay. Um, Why don't you go with Mukure? Finish it with an E. Make it very Latin sounding. Uh, you know what? No, I'm not gonna do that. Well, damn. <laughs> you know, <laughs> one of the <laughs> rules. One of the rules to uh, improv is yes and. So, yes. And... Yeah. So I was supposed to, like by those rules, I really should have put in an E. But you know, now I'm just gonna not. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna throw one of these at you. Now what? Oh, a dot. Uh, well, I'm gonna go back to my letter. There. Uh, uh, I'm gonna go back to my letter, like I said. There. I'm gonna pass it back to you. Makura O. No, Makure. I mean. We're probably not seeing the same thing here on screen. <laughs> but it doesn't matter, because Mario just jumped out of bed. Okay. And he's going to go back to bed. Some days it just be like that, you know? You know, some days I do wish, you know, you would do wake up and you're like, you know what, today is canceled. I'm just going to go back. <laughs> I'm just going to go back to bed. <laughs> and why can't you put that on? He's got a perfectly good spare suit right there. And another hair on, uh, bleh, another hat right there. Why not? Well, Mario is in his blue phase today, dude. He's not feeling it. You know, just sometimes you just gotta be blue. Uh, I like Jinx. He's a cool character. Well, that's why we're staying okay, under. Okay, so hold on, just real quick, just to make sure. You, yeah. You're seeing M L Q U R A dot O, right? No, I see dot E. Dot E. Okay, I saw. Yeah. I see dot O. So maybe what I should do, uh, since well, since we're playing this on an emulator, and I know I know it's kind of verboten to say that around here, but it's 2020. Deal with it. Right. Um. 
I'm gonna try reconnecting to you okay. and see if it fixes it. Okay, go for it. So if you'll give me a second. So like I like like we said, uh, it's a bit of a gimmicky idea, but you know, proof of concept. It does work. Just we need to make sure that we're synced in order for it to actually work. Otherwise, I'll be fighting an enemy. It'll die on my screen. It won't die okay. on the screen. I'm back. You're... So why don't you check the save box? I do now see an O. Okay. So there we go. Perfect. So I think, so thank goodness I don't have to be like, you know, connected to you 100% for this to work. <laughs> mm. So one of the features of this emulator, or rather the C, this random number generator, is that every location except the factory is open right from the beginning. So we could just go straight to Nimbus Land. However, but if we did that, we're probably going to get butt stomped. Yes, all of the enemies are still leveled appropriately. So we want to go to Mushroom Way to fight enemies that like are suitable for our level. See, you're the expert of this, so I'm going to let you go ahead and basically guide us to say, okay, we're kind of leveled up enough, we can go to this zone, because you've played this game so often, I think you have a rough idea uh, honest, of how... Honestly, as long as we just like fight the occasional fight, we should be fine. Like Mario RPG is not a terribly difficult game, but then again, this is the randomizer. Uh, honestly, anything goes. Let's, <laughs> let's, let's be real. So I'm going to fight this Goomba. And according to the RNG, uh, we currently have Gino and Mallow. Uh, we rolled Bowser and Toadstool, that's neither. Toadstool and Bowser again, that's neither. Gino and Bowser, okay, so it says here that player one is Gino. I am player one, so you will take Mallow. Awesome, give me control. I will assume it, and I have assumed it. So let's see, which Goomba do I hate the most? This Goomba looks particularly mean. I don't like him. Alright, go for it. Alright, that's a double punch for 18. Okay, I saw that. Perfect. Alright, uh, it's up to you. Okay, and uh, let's see his magic. I Gino has Mute. That's not a skill that he normally has. Well, he is a very quiet kind of guy, so... I suppose that's true. Like, he's, he, If you think about it, he, he's, like, he possesses a doll in order to be in this game, right? Dolls yeah. generally don't have voice boxes, so... I wonder how Gino does communicate. Does he just voice things at you? <laughs> Maybe. Uh, I see we have three mushrooms, so that's vanilla. Let's just punch this guy. That's a heavy hit. Hit him for 33. Yeah. Okay, so now it is Mario's turn, and Mario will defend. Coward. Mario's like, it's okay, you guys got this. I don't have to do anything. So let's see, I'm gonna take over, and I'm gonna take out this Goomba. For 24 hits. That's a big old meaty hit from Mallow. Well, you know, you, he's he's a Nimbus guy, right? I mean, spoiler alert, but he's not a frog. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so right. I have this RNG currently set up so that we're supposed to swap characters after every fight, but that's going to be a little too much, so we're going to swap after every room. That sounds good. And, so let's get this chest. Oh, damn. We saw that it's the slap glove, at least. Yeah, we did. So you're, so you're still Mallow. Sti Oh, okay, I'm going to stick around with the same characters. Got it. Yeah. All right, let's see that. Um, I'm going to hit Spikies, because Spikies hit hard. That's an eight hit, and I'll give it back to you. And I will continue to fight the Spiky. 21. Is it possible in Super Mario RPG to always get a perfect zero, or are the frames not always that... Can you not block everything perfectly? Uh, I'm fairly certain it's possible, but some things, like some attacks, they have a frame 3 window, something like that. Ooh. Okay, so it says here, for this turn, he will use an item on the 4th page in the 6th slot. So we only have 3 items. So if we can't use an item, like it's grayed out or we just don't have it, then we will go back 1 slot until we can. So in this case, it would be the 6th slot, so we would go back to the 5th slot and then the 4th slot. And once we get to the 1st slot, then we go back a page. And we just keep doing that until we get to an item that we can use, which would be this mushroom. And if a target, if an item targets a single friend, it targets the friend that was most recently attacked, which was who? Uh, uh, which was Mallow. Mallow, go for it. Yeah, he got hit. He got hit for two. Thank you. And now Gino's blocking heavy. Okay. All right. And now... So I'll take over. I will take over, and I will punch this other spiky. And. Uh, I will let you go have it control. You hit double hit him for six, I saw? Yeah. Perfect. And now you just smack that dude in the face for 21. 
Whoever's in control will do the defending. Just yeah, make, that sounds just, good. Just make it easy. Mm -hmm. Alright, next turn, Mario defends. And uh, I guess it's my turn again. There you go. Alright, let's see. I will take out this Sky Troopa. And I'll just hold on until... Okay, there we go. Back to you. Okay, I think we're getting the hang of not getting desync now. Which is good. I hit him for 13, did you see that? Uh-huh, and Perfect. he hit Malo for 2. Perfect. This turn, Mario uses magic. And he only has one spell, Terrorize. A classic Mario move. Yeah, I mean, he obviously learned from Bowser. You know, Bowser's like... I no, have Bowser the best learned tech. from him. It, I just said it's a classic <laughs> Mario move. <laughs> yeah, I, you know, Mario is kind of a scary guy when you think about <laughs> it. Okay, Slap Glove. So like I said, all equipment is randomized. It doesn't necessarily go to Peach, the Slap Glove. It could very well go to Vlader or Mega Mar. And it doesn't. And it goes to nobody. That's yeah, kind of a so, shame. Yeah, so perfectly useless item right there. Maybe this next box? Well, no, never mind. Wilt Shroom. <laughs> if I recall correctly, the Wilt Shroom was an item, like it was a booby prize that you got for winning a great guy's look the other way. Mm -hmm. Which, by the way, we could do that in this randomizer and we don't know what the reward is for doing 100. It could be another Wilt Shroom. Let's fight this Goomba. What is it in the regular game? Star Egg. Ooh, nice. Which, by right. the Star Egg, could be anything. Could be anywhere. Maybe it'll be in the very next box we find. It could be. Very well. Go ahead. 37. Jeez. That was a big aren't hit. Aren't these pile drivers in... Uh, in another, like... We got symbols. The symbols. Aren't, aren't they, like, a late-game boss? Uh, well, they're... I think the pile driver... The pile driver is either found in the factory... Or in no, no, it couldn't be the factory. Factory is like mechanical stuff. Like, okay, it could, it could be either like Bowser's Castle or Barrel Volcano. I want to say maybe Barrel Volcano. Sounds about right. But, he just made a rock. But his stats must have been readjusted. Well, there's a randomizer for you. The symbols also going into one. Normally Perfect. goes to Mallow, but I guess Mallow's not feeling musical this run. No, not this time. So new room. Uh. Battle is over. Player two is now Gino, so it's still the same thing. Oh, jeez. Well, technically, I'm Gino now. You're Mallow. Oh yeah, that's right. I am. So player now you get to take. Now you get to take over. I'm player one. What's my Mallow spell? Therapy. Uh, that's that's a, a that's a Peach skill. It is a Peach skill, but it's, Mallow could also heal, so that's not terribly far off the mark. Yeah, I mean, therapy is a better one, isn't it? Oops. Th therapy is like a, a guaranteed super heal or something like that. Therapy heals status effects as well. HP rain does not. HP rain is just like a baby's first HP heal. So I guess I control Mario this room. Yes, whoever is in control with the last kill gets Mario. You mean, I thought it was just more the room. Who All right, what's in this box? Do you want to take a guess? It could be anything, literally. It could be the star egg. Let's go with that, star egg. It's a frog nope, coin. it's a frog coin. All right, sweet. Uh, I'm guessing that the frog coin still held its value for uh, for what was that? Frog Fucius is his name. Frog Fucius, uh, give me control. Yeah, you got you got it. Go ahead. Frog Fucius requires a rare frog coin, which is a key item. Oh boy, that means we may not even get him till the end of the game. It could very well possibly. No All right. idea. All right. Let's get that guy out of here. Yeah, yeah, okay. Let's uh, jump. Oh, no, wait. There we go. Uh, Alright. Oh, <laughs> and I get ambushed like a newbie. You, you go ahead. Alright. Uh, let's go with this one in the back. Loser. He is a loser. He got he got stomped by one hit. Just Yeah, I just, just checking. I double hit for 24. Yep. Okay. Perfect. And I just hit him for 33. All right. HP max. And now finally Mario's turn. Mario, will use it doing? Use an item. Oh boy. If it targets a single friend, friend that was most recently attacked, which is no one. So I guess that would just be a freebie for. Yeah. If no. if it if it's inapplicable, then just use it on whoever. Thank you. Defend. Good job. I did it. 
All right, here we go. Okay. So Sweet. ideally, ideally, we're not going to be doing every single fight because this is kind of a slow way to doing it. It's just constantly yeah. handing off the controller. But you do get the picture. You got a safe toad. Maybe he'll give us a star egg. <laughs> single, <laughs> single sky trooper. That it's, single it's, sky trooper. It's quite. He's gonna die. It's quite possible. All right. All right. Let's finish this guy. Kill him, Gino. Gino did it. His name is Vlader, thank you. Sorry, it's Gino. It's, it'll always be... Power Blast. Power Blast. What is that? Uh, it's an item that increases uh, attack power. Oh boy. If Mario wastes this, I'm going to be pretty cross. <laughs> he could. Raise raises raises party parties. attack power. Oh, the parties. What am I thinking of then? Power uh, maybe you're thinking of like a... Power boost, oh. maybe? Isn't there also, like, a frog coin somewhere around here? No, I don't think so. Um, in this randomizer, all of the hidden chests are visible. Oh, they're visible. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Caro Caro Cola? After this fight, maybe? Go ahead. Um, in the base game, that box was a full heal. Oh, it wasn't a Caro Cola? Okay. No. 50. Jesus, that was a heavy hit. Yeah, Vader, he's not fucking around. Alright, let's see what's in his chest. Maple a syrup. Maple syrup. That is waste of... That is a waste. It's pretty good. But okay, hold on, hold on. We gotta reroll yeah. characters. Right. Go ahead. Uh, player one is now Gino, so that's me. Alright, you got control. No, no, you're in control still. Oh, I'm in control still? Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's see then. Let's fight this guy. So that means that uh, I get Mallow? Yep. All right, then. Goodbye, Spikey. You will not be missed. Well, maybe when Gino takes over. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hang on. Go ahead. Take a, take control. Perfect. There we go. Okay. I hit him for 28. Yep. Perfect. That's, that's, that's what I saw. Yeah, it was just... Like I said, viewers, uh, still just... There are some kinks. We just got to check every now and again. Good dodge. This oh, is, this is the block. It's a block that's got Toad in his clutches. Ah, I guess what? we're fighting the block. Oh my goodness! Oh. This all is of, an interest. All of Branch we might have fucked up. Um, <laughs> are we gonna die horribly? <laughs> we might. Okay, uh, go for it. Uh, okay. I missed. He He's him, doing Ender Bubble. Hit him! Hit him for one. Nope, he's using Diamond Saw? Diamond Saw, yeah. And it missed. missed. You were in control. Oh, six. You were in control of that, eh? Oh, am I? Okay, sorry about that. Yeah, uh, of defending. Sorry, let me let me uh, go ahead and pass. Go ahead. All right, perfect. Oh, um, hang on a second. These guys, they normally hit for a ton. They only hit for six. That well, means that they are scaled to our level. Yes. So they're scaled here. So I'm going to try Mute on Domino. What's the point of rotating this? I have no idea, and it didn't work. Okay, so Mario will use magic, but he can't. We have none. All right, so he'll re-roll. Use magic again, use an item. And the third slot, oh, maple syrup. Thank God. <laughs> Good timing. Oh, even better. Oh, yeah. Sweet. So I'll take over? Yep. All right, uh, who's the more dangerous one here? I they're both Domino. pretty dangerous. Diamond Saw. Again. Uh, can I... Wow. Keep in mind, you're the healer. Wow. Okay, well, uh, I'll pass Mario to you, I guess. Alright, well, you're the one that's still in control. I suppose you're right. So what is Mario doing here? I guess you're in control forever now. Oh. Oh boy. Mario well, you still gotta guide me. <laughs> Mario uses magic. Okay. Uh, Terrorize is an all target skill, right? Yep. Alright, let's uh. Start let's rotating. rotating. Uh... Well, that was a. Oh, you got one. one. Oh, right. We have to fight the snake. 
This one might be a wash. Luckily, uh, Super Mario RPG, it's very forgiving when it comes to game overs. We will go Ooh. back. We will go back to our last save, but we keep all the experience that we gained. Uh oh. Oh, I didn't realize that was an attack. Yep. Oh, Gino's back. He oh, looks I, have, like he is. I, I have one HP. Uh, I'm gonna heal you just in case. Okay. Sounds like you missed, but. <laughs> Ooh. All right. Quick pass dodge. It to you. Okay. God, I hope my mouse isn't showing up on the recording. <laughs> we'll find out soon. Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. I trust uh... you. I believe in you. Should I keep healing? We only have one mushroom. I want. I kind of want to use it on Mario, and then hope you can survive to use therapy on yourself. That's a good point. Go for it. On Mega Mario, Mega... rather. Well, Mega Mario's gonna have to use an item. Maybe. Maybe. Next turn. Uses magic. He cannot. We roll. Defends. Oh god. Six? Oh, and it's fear. Poison is fear now. Oh, well, okay. I don't know how that works, but okay. Um, so, I can't use therapy. <laughs> uh, Alright. Uh, what items do we have? Power Blast? Strat Maybe we should use Power Blast. Okay. Or Maple Syrup to heal to get our HP back? Or our, ma our magic back, maybe? Our magic back, yeah. That's what I would do. Let's do it. Another freebie would be great. Okay. That was my fault. I don't know the timing for this stuff. That's no, that's totally fair. Go ahead. Uh, I guess I'll keep aiming for Cloaker. Hole six. Mario, do something good. Mario attacks. That's fucking. Oh. <laughs> oh. Two. Ooh. 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 This is scary. This is actually. You this should, is actually one of the tighter. Yeah, yeah heal. you should heal. <laughs> and hope Mario doesn't waste our FP. Alright, I messed that up. Oof. I, I keep. <sighs> no, it's fine, it's fine. Don't go worry ahead, about go it. Ahead, go that's ahead. just. That's all part and parcel to the randomizer. If we take out Cloaker, what happens? He just stops. We still have to take out the snake. For this turn, Mario uses magic. Well, it's still hit everybody. <laughs> Rotating so hard. Well, that's a pretty good hit, actually. Carny kiss. Carny kiss. Oof. <laughs> hmm. All right, we're still what? in. Should I heal or should I? You can't. Should I fight? We're out of FP. Oof. Uh, Item-wise, what do you think? I don't know. Uh, Terrorize did hit for quite a lot. Hmm. Okay then. I think, we'll, uh, I think we'll just rock it. I can't hit. I can't target Cloaker. Yeah, he's yeah, dead. yeah, because he's dead. Yeah. Oh, I see. He's still up in the, in the snake, though. Yeah, he's still on top of the snake, but the little lightning. You hit him for one, right? I did. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Very pathetically, I might add. So it's your go. Okay, just making sure. God, I really hope that like that. Now that I see it, is really distracting. I hope it's not showing up on the on the recording. <laughs> you hit him for six. Okay. And Mario uses magic, he can not. Mario attacks. It lagged on me. Carnicus! Oof! That Zero. was a perfect that was a perfect dodge. Good that job. Is exactly what we needed. Thank god you're actually skilled at this. <laughs> and for two. A whole two. I'm no longer feared, so that's good. Fear has your attack power, right? And defense. Oosh. Mario attacks again. Oh, the RNG must be feeling our pain. I'm doing, I'm doing my best. Yeah, yeah, you're doing very well. You're carrying this team. <laughs> okay, passing it to you. There we go. Nice. That was that was messy. I was, was a f not expecting that. 26 coins and 2 experience. Just 2 for all of the pain we went through. We got, we a, got wallet. a wallet.
Okay, uh, we can sh we can sell that for like 555 coins or give it to the guy for, I think, two frog coins? But maybe randomize, can't it? Maybe he'll give us two items. That's true. Okay, how... We need four experience to level up everyone. Do you want to just grind a little bit? Yeah, yeah, let's level up. I mean, that was a, that was a, a, a Actually, very butt-clenching fight. Hold on, hold on. 